So how was it possible that we could deliver upon this product so fast and so quickly? Well, it was mainly because we had so many committed stakeholders on board, internally and externally. So uh, I was very fortunate to work with uh, a number of colleagues that committed to this product because we all knew that testing was the most critical investment for the country at this time. And externally, uh, we had the same type of commitment with support from Department of Health, Department of Foreign Affairs, Department of Finance, Department of Defense, and of course the hospital, Kosia Bielinga. This laboratory is going to increase the testing capacity of the Philippines by 3,000 tests a day. That's 10% of the country's testing capacity target. And so it's an extraordinarily important initiative. It's an absolute critical piece of the country's strategy for creating a new normal situation in the wake of this crisis. It is uh, a, indeed a significant uh, support in the national government's uh, uh, objective or goal to wrap up its uh, daily testing output uh, from an initial 300 per day and now uh, we are, we're doing 7,000 and hopefully with this capacity we will be able to do 10 to 11,000 and continuously uh, improve and increase our uh, daily uh, testing uh, output. Today we are actually focusing on the diagnosis of COVID-19 disease. But in our vision, this molecular pathology lab will also be uh, a center for uh, as a sub-national reference, uh, referral lab for other emerging and emerging infectious diseases.